Are you taking calcium every day? You might actually be doing more harm than you are doing good. Calcium can't get into your bones without the right micronutrients. So it can end up staying in your bloodstream, in your soft tissue, and even in your joints. So if you want to make this work, you really need to make sure you're getting vitamin D3, specifically that form, vitamin K2, and magnesium. Those can be really challenging to get into our food systems, blueberries, Swiss cheese, um, spinach, but spinach actually can be a negative, and I'll tell you why after this. So if you are taking a supplement, you want to make sure that you have those in it as well. So that calcium actually goes where it's supposed to go. And now we're going to go over things that you want to make sure that you avoid too. Now, substances like oxalates, which are in spinach and in beets, can actually cause calcium not to be absorbed well. So you don't want to take those together. Phytates are another one. That would be things like whole wheat and beans. So do not take your morning calcium with some whole wheat toast. You're negating some of the benefit there. Really keep that in mind. Increased sugar, alcohol, and high levels of caffeine can also affect that absorption rate. So really make sure you check that supplement label. Without those nutrients, you may be hurting your joints and just wasting money. So make sure you look.